Hi, my name is Tim Judson and I'm with the Don't Nuke the Climate campaign. We are an international coalition working to stop nuclear power and other dirty energy industries from derailing climate action and hijacking our clean energy future. Next month, the world's leaders are meeting in Bonn, Germany to decide how to make good on the global climate agreement signed by 195 countries. To avoid the worst impacts of global warming, we have to start reducing greenhouse gas emissions and we have to move to clean, renewable energy sources as quickly as possible. Nuclear power will never be a solution to this problem. It is too expensive and too slow to reduce carbon emissions, and it is too dirty and too dangerous in its own right, destroying human lives and the environment in the process. Indigenous peoples and people of color are unfairly targeted for radioactive waste, and women and children are disproportionately affected by radiation. These are violations of basic human rights. The Don't Nuke the Climate campaign is uniting people from around the world to take this message to the Global Climate Conference in Bonn next month. We are groups from South Korea to South Africa, from Austria to Australia, from Russia to North America. We are organizing demonstrations and informational events at the climate conference, and we are bringing the voices of people affected by nuclear power to the climate negotiations and holding countries accountable. The real solutions to climate change are at our fingertips. We can make the switch to a carbon-free, nuclear-free world through energy efficiency and 100% renewable energy sources like solar, wind, geothermal, and tidal power, all within a generation. But we have to start now, and we can't let fake solutions like nuclear power get in the way. We need you to join us, and we need your support. We hope you will donate what you can to our campaign, even if you can't join us in Germany in November, which most people can't. But your donation will help us bring grassroots activists from impacted communities to show world leaders that we can, we must, and we will meet the challenge of global warming without sacrificing our future to nuclear waste. Thanks for your support and for all that you do to stand up for human rights and environmental justice.